off of there. Um, just in the essence of time, I'll take it off for you. Unless anybody's like really wants that experience of moving the tie. <laughs> no, we'll trust no? you. You're all like, just do it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, pie. When this falls out like this, it's called pie. You ever heard that before? No. I had a. Oh, we used the little word. <laughs> the one. <laughs> the foot of the word. The one. The lady who like really taught me how to do this was really had this really thick German accent. And she would do that. She did that without explaining why she was doing that. And we're like, why is she yelling pie at us? We don't know what she's talking about. It took a little while <laughs> to understand what the pie was. There you go. Um, will you bring your lines over? some funky things. There's a space here. Um, these are kind of uh, different from some of the other lines. My suggestion and would be to put these on top so you have an irregular line um, and then the rest of the block on the bottom. So if there's no objections, that's what I'll do. Okay. Okay. Uh, can we have your other one? <laughs> um, let's see. Can I have a FICA ruler? They should be right behind you on the shelf there. Are they all going? No. All right, there you go. Oh, thank you. So this is, we measured it, it's 50. This one is also 50. So we only have 70 to work with, right? We want this to fit in this hole. So what I would do, um, this is 30 without these end things. So that gets us closer. So if you don't mind, I'm going to take these off. So we can fit it on the, we can fit it right here. Um, then we're going to get real creative here. We're going to take out this. Can you pull some 50 pica rig, or I'm sorry, 15 pica riglets? And all I'm doing is adjusting the spacing to make this fit on the line. Uh, can you get some of the half and the one picas? They're in this other cabinet. Thank you. Yeah, that's good. So we're squishing, squishing, squishing. Is it true that Gutenberg committed suicide? <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> I can't take it anymore. <laughs> Nothing fits. I quit. <laughs> Nothing fits. I quit. I have a friend who's like that. Well, actually, H. When she comes into this room, oh my word, she better have a job to do because she hates this part. So we're getting closer here. We're squishing, squishing. I'm going to squish this too. Oh man, we're almost there. We're at 71 and a half. Um, may I have just a few more of those? Sure. It's good if you have a friend. Mm -hmm. Pull some stuff for you. The little one, huh? That's fine. I'll do that. I'll try that. Okay. I think we're pretty close there. Now we need something to go to finish this line here. This is probably a 50. So could I have a 25 by 2? Oh. So How the way that? 25 would be the length oh, on the side, right? Okay. And then two by. Thank you. This one is too long. How is that? 25. Oh, because it's 70, not 75. So we need a 20. I'm sorry. 20. <laughs> 20. Okay. Good. Trace it. You have to be able to add. That's also <laughs> something I learned when I got here. Okay, you've got to put things back. Really? I can see just all of this stuff to have to put back away. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, there's like so can I, what happened to your little guys that were up here? Let's um, put those back. And then also we have this. Okay, so how wide? This is about, a, well this we know is 35. And I'm going to measure here. So how long? We need it to be 35 long and four wide. Four? 
So four of them. Right. Which you no. won't find, so we'll yeah. have to add it. Uh, okay. You can maybe pull four, one. Yeah, there's not a of. thirty-five, there's just thirty. Exactly. So if you look in the riglet, we okay. have thirty-five pike along there, so just pull four. Four of them. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's yeah. right. That's right. Oh, well, we didn't change the inside, so that should be that should be okay. We'll see when we get it really locked in. We might not need this top guy. I don't know if yeah. this is a little funky, but we'll we'll figure that out. Let's stick this. Yeah, he's here. high though. He's high on the arm. Oh no, it's not. He's in. All right, so we're getting nice and square, huh? Yeah, mm -hmm. that's good. Okay, so we don't need all this. And I usually just make a big key from five pipes now. I don't put it away till later, but that's great. Uh, okay, and we're 48, our block is 48 long, so we need to add up, it would be easier if we could make this, um, oh wait, that's okay. So this is 70, so we gotta fill in these holes, this and this. Um, and the easiest thing to do would be to fill in furniture here that 70 pikas long. So we want to start with the biggest pieces first and that would be the 50s, you know, whatever adds up to 70 by 10 wide. That's good. And then I need some 20s to match to, to complete the line. 20s and 10, 20 tens? Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Okay. One time I saw this little drawing of a living room on top of a press bed. Get it? <laughs> it's really cool. Okay, and then also it's important to stagger them, and that's a structural thing. Um, this, you know, sometimes they're a little bit off size-wise, so if you have a whole stack of 50s lined up and 20s, they're a little wonky. So we do this thing, which I've been told by my construction friends is very common in building stuff too. So maybe one more set that's 50 and 20 by 10. Let's try that. All right, okay. And then we, it looks like we still have maybe a half a pica. So we need something that's a half pica wide but adds up to 70. 50? Yeah, that's good. This is actually a one pica. Oh. That one's one, two. Okay. So, oh, here. Skinny or, yeah, yeah here. there you go. Okay. Thank you. Um, and then can I have a 20 that's that, that's that thick? Right here. Yeah, right here. Perfect. Okay. So this is successful over here. So that's good. Now we have this space, and usually what I do is just fill in 100 wide all the way down. Most presses have a little bar that comes up and clanks. Or a bit, you know, lock it in. Mm -hmm. I've never had it since I've been here. So I have to fill this in with furniture. So, uh, can we pull, can, we need to pull furniture that adds up to 100. And again, I always start with the biggest pieces and then work my way down. Okay. These are the biggest last things. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Gotta go down the rooms to go because we're going to So you can do 60s and 40s. <laughs> I have 12 wide. So yeah, that's fine. I don't care. Two thirties and a four. Perfect. And just a little bit left. So maybe two. Um, let's see here. Let's do 250 
by one pike of riglets. Thanks, Mimi. Let's see. This is a little weird. Yeah, I didn't part. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I didn't part. Okay, with. So what I want to do is here's this nice solid line up. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. I can't. Wow. <laughs> okay. So can we remove this just to a non out of the way place? Now that we've got all of our furniture in there that will fit, we can use the coins, um, this is what these guys are, to lock in the press the rest away, and basically they just expand by using the key to crank them out. Oh, we got a big, we got a bigger hole here than I thought. So, can I have 250 by two pikas, please? And those are in the furniture cabinet. In the furniture? All the way to the air. Fifty yeah. Oh. Uh, my bad. <laughs> Forgot to add. I'd still be like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? Use real words. <laughs> so now I'm cranking, and I do this incrementally. <laughs> this like this coin is completely cranked out, so I need another half pica by something that adds up to seventy and a half pica width. So thirty times. Uh, this is when my students are like, oh. Uh, I just want to print it. Why is it taking so long? <laughs> Sorry. Perfect. So we're cranking and I'm pushing things down because sometimes they want to like escape. And we need them to be perfectly level. Now one thing I didn't tell you which we can talk about now is type high. This press is specifically made to print pieces of type. Type high is 0.918 of an inch. I don't know why. It just is. So everything in this press, this is weird, we have to fix that. Mm -hmm. Everything that goes in needs to be that height. So if we print a, a woodcut or a CNC block, we build it up by putting paper or wood or something like that. Um, so now that my coins are locked in, I'm checking. Is anything moving? This stuff is pretty good. This is pretty good. This is a problem. But it's an easily, hopefully, easily solved problem. This is a 30... Two, these are weird. This is a 32 pica riglet, maybe by a half. Hopefully that will solve that problem there. You're hired. <laughs> <laughs> I told you I'm good for something. Yeah. <laughs> my, my husband is in IT, and we joke about how different our jobs are. <laughs> it's all adding, but his is way more complicated than mine. Okay, so this is good. Hey, good job, you guys. Look, ta-da! Ta it's ready to print. Yeah. <laughs>